Well, uh, we need to start from, from the history and uh, also what the companies are doing. So both companies are uh, dealing with uh, long haul and short haul uh, radio uh, equipment. And uh, in initially, actually, both companies were working in different areas and were stronger. In, each company was stronger in another area. In other words, in Europe, Seragon was more uh, was stronger, while in Brazil, for instance, Nera was stronger. But starting more from the history, uh, when I was uh, Seragon started in Brazil about four and a half years ago, and since then we doubled our sales every year. Uh, until last year when we when we are together with Nera, so the sales will be four times bigger. So complementing, we have two, po two products that are complementing each other and together we are going to triple, to quadruple our sales. So together we actually we service all big operators in Brazil. And a part of it, we have also big clients like ISPs, and other customer vertical customers. We are going to offer both short haul and long haul, so both X Seragon and X Nera products to the same client. Uh, there is a big need in Brazil for telecommunication. There is lack of infrastructure that help us, or there is a need for our products for all the years until the Olympics and, and, and also for the Olympics itself. So there is a big market for us as a company here. And if we are talking today about 20% of market share in Brazil, we are going to increase from this as well.